So there are plenty of bosses you will come across during the main story, but this one for me has had the best loot so far. So whatever you do when you get to this stage, please loot the body off of this boss, people. How's it going, guys? My name's DPJ, and if you enjoyed the video, leaving a like really helps out. And if you like what you see and want to see more Cyberpunk, be sure to subscribe. Okay, so doing the main quest after the prologue, 14 missions in, you'll come to a mission called Play It Safe. This mission consists of you working with Takamura. The mission will consist of you having to take out snipers and then going on to find a net runner. Upon finding the net runner, you'll be confronted by a boss called Sandeu Oda. This is the dude who beholds a nice bunch of legendaries and an epic iconic sword. So take him down. Now he is a little bit awkward to fight as he's so quick, but thanks to Cyberpunk and its bugs ongoing in the game, well for me he just stood there and allowed me to lay down that damage on him. Now upon you taking him out, you are asked to spare his life. Doing so or not doesn't change the outcome with the loot you can grab from him. So do what you have to do and take him down. Upon him lying there, or floating there as in my case, loot that body. You should get at least two legendaries and an epic. The epic is an iconic sword and it's called the Jinchu Maru. And this thing is just utterly brutal. With a 249.7 damage per second and a 99 damage stat. With a 2.5 attack speed, so quick for a melee weapon which is great. With a plus 63 to 77 physical damage, minus 8.20 stamina cost while attacking which is amazing. A plus 32.8 crit damage bonus and a plus 15% bleeding chance. Also guys, this sword gains 100% crit chance while Kerenzikov is active. Last strike in a combo deals double damage and double damage against enemies twice your current health. So it's quite the sword it really is. You also get this Arazaka Engineer hard hat with headset. This headwear has a 21 armor stat too. It also has 3 mod slots which is great. And you also get the Arazaka polycarbonate laced bulletproof aramid vest. This has a 72.5 armor stat with a plus 15% crit damage bonus. Increases carrying capacity by 5 also. And it also has a mod slot. So that's pretty amazing. So yeah guys just a quick video on the loot you can get from older items I feel you must get. So when you do come across this dude and you do kill him or take him down, don't forget to loot his body. And yeah guys, the end of the video is near, just a short but sweet one, reminding all you amazing people of the loot you will sometime or another come across. So grab it while you can, because you can't go back to this dude. And on that note, the end of the video has arrived. If you enjoyed it, leaving a like really helps out. If you're new around here and want to see more Cyberpunk, be sure to subscribe. And if you never want to miss a video I upload, you can turn notifications on by hitting that bell button. But guys, thanks as always for stopping by. Hopefully you enjoyed the video and hopefully I will see you on that next one.